So the piece that I chose from the Miami Art Museum art exhibit was um, Luis Jimenez's Reflejo de Choco. Um, Jimenez himself was a Mexican-American um, artist from El Paso, Texas, and um, he would often comment on popular culture and social commentary um, with regards to his identity and his artwork. Um, his work is also noted for capturing kind of, you know, like the more bolder aspects of his culture, such as um, including prostitutes and lowriders in some of his paintings, this one included. Um, and Reflejo del Choco relates directly to this idea as this painting depicts a scene in a street time at night um, with a prostitute looking at a potential client in a car while a man with a heart tattoo smiles at her from across the bar. And I have an image of it right here, as you can see. So there's the car and there's the prostitute with the man and the tattoo looking across the car at the woman and the woman notices him. And um, um, the painting is a social commentary seven color lithograph, which means that Jimenez drew this on a flat stone or surface and then the colors came together through some sort of chemical process. Um, and I felt a connection with this piece mainly because of its use of vibrant colors. Me personally, I'm not a huge fan of art, but the painting itself just caught my eye directly because of its use of so many colors into one to just make this scene that almost kind of seemed like it told a story. And I immediately began thinking like, what's the story behind this? I really want to know um, why are there three people in the street? Like, I felt like there was more to this. So I ended up doing a little bit of research on this piece and found that this art piece itself demonstrates a common theme of Jimenez, which is um, a concern for, you know, the working class Latinos that also suffer from discrimination and violence in their communities. And the painting shows what looks to be like a gang member taking advantage of a poor woman. So the theme shows that um, um, it connects to the violence that many poor Latin American countries face. Um, and it also comments on the everyday lives of so many Latino Americans that struggle with poverty and making ends meet, which is a common theme that we studied in our class. And um, in general, it was interesting just to see this painting um, represent something that we've been studying so much in class. And um, it gave me a greater understanding of how some people um, from these areas that we're studying feel about the themes that we're learning. So I felt that it was really cool to get an idea of this. And it was really cool um, doing a little more research on this painting that I found.